I welcome you once again to the channel. Today our father is again explaining the effective use of the name Jesus for a result. If you really want to use the name Jesus effectively, which yield the result, please stick to this channel. Sit down and watch the whole video to the end. God bless you. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe and share. God bless you. Powerful is when we are fully developed. Fully developed to an extent where you are exempted. You are liberated from certain laws that are natural on the earth. You, you, you are, you, 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 are, you become immune to the influence of the earth. And you start getting influenced by a foundation that is above you. That's when the supernatural begins to happen. Because whilst you are here, and you are being governed by the laws being emitted from your foundation, the earth. You will always have restrictions. You can't walk on water. Okay? Yes, 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 yes. This earth yes. has been given to this earth to maintain that principle, making sure everything that goes up comes down. Conforms to the principles of nature. Yes. Okay. But there is an exemption that you get when you are thoroughly born again. Fully born and completely <laughs> It is given to another kingdom to control you. You are fully developed. Yes. It is given to another kingdom to control you. To control you. The men on the earth can look at you when you are ascending city in the channel. And you are, you are seeing horses. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He didn't say strange creatures, they were horses. Mm. These were horses. And a chariot had wheels. Mm. 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 Wheels for what if there is no road in there? He said, My father, my father. The chariot of Israel, no, and the horsemen thereof. Now, when you tighten up the ropes, the connection, when that connection between you and the Spirit mm -hmm. seated in Christ mm -hmm. in heavenly places and your physical body on the earth mm -hmm. whilst you are the one born again, living in two worlds mm -hmm. the one in you mm -hmm. the Spirit in you mm -hmm. right. and you are seated, you are that tall if you are seated him in the heavenly places. He, he, the spirit you now begins to control you, the flesh. Okay, yes, sir. Now, when he moves, you move. He doesn't move because you have moved on the earth. Okay, this one. He moves, you move. So, pastors, this 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 subject is very critical. Yes, sir. Very critical because it determines the 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 the, the lifestyle that you are then going to live yes, mm -hmm. as a child of God. Yes, mm -hmm. sir. When you are now being Influenced, you are under the influence of the man born again, the new man who is now born from above. We, we, we taught on that. Yes. Born from above. That is what the name born again means. It means born from above. You are being influenced from above. You, 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 you prosper from above. You make impact from above. Even if you have to marry, you marry from above. Everything you do is from above. 
it is from a heavenly perspective. Mm. And your life then at that moment becomes mysterious because you are being guided by a superior power mm. Mm. which is above. And you are receiving uh, adequate uh, heavenly energy. And you begin to do things that will prove to other people around you that you are in touch with a, a different kingdom. You, you, you can't be an American ambassador living in Zimbabwe and not have a contact, a line that links you with the country that you represent. Yes. It's impossible to have an ambassador. But when that link now is established, it is what you then begin to do and say, up there, that happens down here. Wow. Wow. Hey, everyone. When a man who is down here says what has already been said by the men above, begin to see results. And the word of two witnesses, and the mouth of two witnesses, every word shall be established. Mm. When it is spoken in the heavens, when it is decreed in the heavens, <laughs> you see, that is the reason why you have two people, both mentioning the name the same name, Jesus, and yet the results, the outcome is different. Yes. Yet it was the same owner of that name who said, in my name, mm. this is what you do. Mm. Mm. You cast out demons in my name. When somebody had that, goes on to cast demons, the sons of skill. And they called upon the name of Jesus. Mm, mm. It wasn't just spoke to the nation. Mm. Jesus. The same name that Jesus said, if you, you call, call upon mm. in the name of Jesus, you mm. cast out Jesus. Mm. This one refused to be cast out. Why? It is where you are calling that name from that made us. Wow. When he said in my name, people thought he, he was saying, by saying in the name of Jesus, then you can get the work done. It is not what you're saying. This is why sometimes when you get into our healing sessions, yes, yes. you can start and end without saying, without saying mm -hmm. that we are healing in the name. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because the in has nothing to do with you saying in the name of Jesus. It has everything to do with you being in the name of Jesus. And you cast from the name. In my name, he's talking about a location. Not what you say. Casting them whilst you are in my name. And demons have a way of finding out. <laughs> whether you are using his name or you are speaking from his name. Because when we are seated in heavenly places, Jesus becomes the place. He, 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 he's like a, he's like a police officer when he stands uh, at the center of a traffic light. Whether the lights are working at that moment, they're no longer working. You follow what the police officer is saying. So the presence of Jesus in that heavenly dimension, while it's we are with him there, he is in charge. We are not just sitting in heaven, we are sitting in him. Therefore, if any man be in Christ, not with Christ, but in Christ, he is a what? A new creation. A new creature. So when you speak from there, watch this, when you are there and you speak as a child of God, forget about your biological father, forget about your earthly origin, mm -hmm. you don't belong there. 
when you have this consciousness in your mind as a spirit that I am a product of God. I am a product of God. Mm. I am God material. Mm. When you when you know that, and then you speak after knowing that, mm. when you speak from that dimension, mm. you see what is happening is when you begin to see miracles happening on the earth. God was so careful when He created the earth. Don't just look at what He said. You have to look at where He was when He said what He said. When you speak from above. And your words are descending. <laughs> you want to see results on the earth. Mm. <laughs> mm. I, I, I want, I want, I want, I want, I want people to understand something. I'll, I'll get to things that we have on the earth at some point that are represented by certain things that are in the heavens, in certain foundations. Like I told you, you say some of the things that you see here, they don't belong here. Yes. Mm -hmm. How is it possible? Why would you bind anything you on the earth and it is bound in heaven? What requires binding in heaven? Hmm. There's a duality of these things. Hey. What we are what we are calling man on the earth is a representation of man. All the materials, all the gold, the diamonds, everything you can talk of. The worst quality in terms of percentage is what we have down here. We were given a representation so that we can interact with something that is closer to the reality. How can you bind something here and then it is bound in heaven? What requires binding in heaven? Which heaven is he talking about? Yes, sir. That you can do something here and then something is done up there. What is that? When you finally become successful, you will be managing wealth from that realm. Not here. When you control things from there now, <laughs> everything else that you see here, it's just copying. It is being controlled by a force above again. Everything you own, the rest of the things that are not born again, that are not yours, they remain bound by the powers of the earth. And there's the prince of this world in charge of that force that controls activities on the earth. But when you are born again, everything that is yours on the earth, you will submit to a heavenly governance. There is a power above that will begin to control your things that you have on the earth. 